Hello everybody, thank you so much for joining us today for our third in our series of Colour Astrology, focusing on the colour palette for July, which is Coral Blush. So today we're going to create a trug basket. So we've got this lovely white trug that we're going to use that's actually going to show off the um, Coral Blush colour palette to an absolute perfection. So this divinely centered and delicate arrangement would make a perfect gift to place in the bedroom if you're welcoming guests to your home. The handle makes it actually quite easy for a guest to carry home afterwards and it has a 360 degree sort of design to it so it can be viewed from almost any angle. So loads of opportunities to place it on a table or somewhere where people are walking past. So the flowers I'm going to use today are beautiful rose, really chunky rose this, for want of a better word. This is lovely Dolomiti, so a really nice firm head for that one. I've got some fantastic peonies, everybody's favourite. This one's Sarah Bernhardt, so it has a fantastic fragrance. I've got some really delicate little spray roses here. And this is a really nice variety. This is one that's called Royal Porcelana. Now I appreciate that that's kind of an ivory tone as opposed to the coral blush, but I'm going to use that to kind of like give a little bit of balance to the coral tones. So the foliage that I'm going to use today is Senecchio Maritima, which is this one. You might also know that as Dusty Miller and also everyone's favourite, Eucalyptus. And this variety is Cinerea. Okay, so I've placed an actually biodegradable wet foam brick that's pre-soaked into my trug. <clears throat> Got the white trug as I mentioned earlier. And my only tools today that I'm gonna need are some 12 millimeter pot tape or anchor tape and my trusty scissors. All right, so enjoy. I hope it inspires you to have a go yourselves.
So I hope you've enjoyed my demonstration today of how to create a truck basket arrangement using that fabulous coral blush colour palette. Now as always I have some top tips for you. My first top tip is peonies. Now to enjoy them at their best you may need to condition them in advance to making the arrangement up so that they actually develop at the same time as the roses. Peonies are notoriously difficult to get to bloom um, or notoriously difficult to force open shall we say. So just bear that in mind if you're using them. Top tip number two make sure there are no holes in your basket that you're using. So either pre-line it yourself, or if you're buying one that is already lined, just do a little check with some water in there first to make sure there's no drippage. And then top tip number three, avoid placing this design in direct sunlight or near a heat source. Um, obviously, the hotter it is, the less you'll have shelf life wise. So to enjoy it at its best, keep it somewhere nice and cool, keep it topped up with water. All right. Well, I hope you've enjoyed our design today, our celebrating July on the colour palette of Coral Blush. So join us for the next in our series, which is corporate design, again celebrating that fabulous Coral Blush colour scheme. So don't forget to like us, share us with your friends, and pop over to our YouTube channel and subscribe for lots more tips, hints, and inspirational ideas for flowers and designs that you can create yourselves. Thanks for watching. I look forward to welcoming you back again very soon. Bye for now.